Hi, my name is Dr. Alan Mandel. Today I want to talk about the difference between rheumatoid arthritis and osteoarthritis. For our situation, I'm more concerned about osteoarthritis. That is the most commonly degenerative joint disease known today by man. Osteoarthritis is a condition where there is wear and tear to the joints, generally the big joints. The joints that stabilize the most weight, like the knees, the hips, the lower back. You find very little bit of osteoarthritis in the elbows or the wrist because there's not a lot of weight bearing to those joints. Rheumatoid arthritis is an autoimmune disease that generally will affect both joints of the body. The two hands, the two wrists, both sides of the body. Osteoarthritis is more commonly to affect just one side of the body but can affect both as well. So if a person has swelling, inflammation of a joint, particularly the knee, and it's unilateral where it's only one-sided, that needs to be looked at specifically from an x-ray to, to determine how much degeneration, how thin the joint space is, how much inflammation is going on, and how much loss of function. One of the best things we can do for osteoarthritis is to make sure we take that heavy weight bearing off the joint. If you're obese, or you're overweight, we need to lose the weight. If you're sedentary and you're not exercising and moving the joint around, we need to start exercising. You may not be able to run, you may not be able to pound and do the things you used to do, but the movement will increase the novial fluid to get back within the joint, help increase circulation, help warm up the muscles, and help accelerate the healing process so you can be the person that you need to be. Have a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.